Welcome to EdJoint's Redesign Interview System. This walkthrough will guide you in creating a paperless interview in the EdJoint system for your organization. Starting from the applicant tracking page, click view for the job posting you want to create an interview for. From the list of applicants being considered for your job opening, check the interview box for each applicant you want to invite to the interview. Next, click the Process Application drop-down menu and select Interview System. This will take you to the Interview System homepage. If you've previously created and saved an interview for this job posting, the interview will be listed towards the bottom of the screen, and you can click Edit to complete the interview setup. To create a new interview, click the Add New Interview button. The required fields are marked with a red asterisk. Start by typing the name of the interview and the location. You can base this new interview from a pre-existing one by choosing the title of that interview from the drop-down menu. Next, select the Interview Proctor from the drop-down menu. Through the EdJoin Interview app, the Interview Proctor will have access to the summary page. This shows the calculated averages of the interview scores from the interview panels. In addition, the Interview Proctor will be able to turn off the access to the interview app once the interview is complete. Select the interview rating sheet that is stored in your EdJoin library. If you need to make changes to the interview rating sheet or do not have one available, go to the interview library from the library menu. Then click Create Interview once each field is complete. To create the date and time for the interview, click the calendar under the Start Date Time field to open up the calendar window. Choose the date and towards the bottom, click the clock to select the time for the interview. Do the same steps for the end date time field. Then click the plus sign to add the time and date for the interview. Click the panel access off checkbox to remove the interview from the EdJoint interview app. Next is the scheduling section for both the interview candidates and the interview panel members. Click the blue plus sign to add applicants to the interview. This will add a blank entry. Then select the applicants from the dropdown. If you need to select another applicant who is not marked for interview on the applicant tracking grid, change the filter to All Being Considered and select that applicant from the dropdown. Next, click the pencil icon to create the interview schedule for the candidate. Then click Save. The next few columns will display the interviewee's name and contact information. Under the Notes column, click the paper icon to write a note about the interview candidate. The note will only appear in the applicant's profile. You can email each interview candidate by clicking the envelope icon. Or you can email all interview candidates by clicking the Email All Candidates link right above. Click the red X on the right side to remove the interview candidate. For the Interview Panel section, click the plus sign to add the panel members to the interview. Choose the panel members from the Select drop-down. In order for their name to appear on this list, they must have an EdJoint admin profile to have access to this interview in the EdJoint interview app. Click the red X to remove the interviewer. Once you choose the interview panel member, their contact information will appear in the next column. If there is no contact information on their profiles, then these fields will be blank. You can also email each interviewer separately or click the Email All Interviewer Panelists link right above. Towards the bottom of the page is a notes section to add notes or review all the notes that reflect this interview. Once the interview setup is complete, click the Save Interview button. If you have any questions on the new interview setup, contact support and thank you for using EdJoint.